There they are, that's Maroon 5 on 2FM, Jenny's favourite. Yeah, I love them. <laughs> them and Taylor Swift. Anyway. Did they ever feature in the club sandwich or anything? Would you call Never. Away, no. Would you call I have on. the gift of hearing. So anyway, this is the exciting part of the show that we uh, we kicked off the other week with uh, Carl Mullen, mm-hmm. our crash test dummy. Our real life yeah. crash test dummy. Just Human for, being. If anyone there. missed it, the, Carl was the very man who said, listen, I'm willing to do Anything is that what you said, Carl? Anything? Well, I wouldn't now quote me directly. Well, you did say that, <laughs> just so we're clear. You did, but he also said, "Oh yeah, I'd love to train with like a perfect go go to train with Manchester United." We were like, yeah, "Wouldn't we all?" Yeah, <laughs> no, 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 <laughs> that's not gonna happen. See what the training is like. Yeah, that was the reason. Okay, well, do you know what? Is your dreams come true because you're on a plane today to Manchester? Sweet. <laughs> no. That's not gonna now, last week we spray tan them in the corner. There was mm. a lot of uh, girly kind of. Whoa! Going on because it was quite cold, yeah, wasn't it? Was it was freezing, man. Give me a break. <laughs> but it, it looked good at the end. Yeah. Happy? As I said yesterday, I'm the most complimented man in the building this week for uh, having a tan. And how does that make you feel? <laughs> I might go back for another To be tan, fair, to be now, you, have you seen what's upstairs? <laughs> <laughs> Well, Jenny, you're not going to be allowed to go upstairs Listen, after that comment. I'm going straight out afterwards. It's fine. So tell us, there was a slight problem though. You were a bit upset because it's after starting making your nails a bit brown. Look, like, do you know when uh, if you smoke, sometimes your fingernails go yellow. So I've got yellow toenails. We could be putting <laughs> okay. a nice colour on them now soon. <laughs> don't you worry. Right, well, today, Carl. Are you ready? We made you when? wear spandex. Yeah, that's yes. I, the, the only thing I know is that I'm top to toe in spandex. I'm absolutely <laughs> roasted, by the way. <laughs> okay, well, joining us in the shooting... Studio, this girl, lady beside you, this girl beside you, uh, her name is Gillian Mooney and uh, she's a yoga expert. Isn't that right, right Gillian? Right, okay. And have you ever done yoga before, Carl? It, yeah, this is important. I'm the least flexible person oh, on, no. on the entire planet. <laughs> okay, that's fine. When was the last time you farted? <laughs> But yoga makes that sometimes happen in yoga, right? I'm right with that. I am right. <laughs> Listen, if it happens to you, we, I'll, I, honestly, I promise you, I'll have your back. I'll say it with Nikki. <laughs> <laughs> right, anyway, oh, let's no. let's find out from Gillian. A bit more serious. Gillian, you, um, you've been to India a few times. Uh, the practice you do is Ashtanga practice yoga, is Ashtanga that right? Ashtanga yoga, yes. Yeah. So where I've been at in India for about, I've been at about 12 times. Okay. I spent about five solid years studying out there. In the, I suppose, the source of this particular style of yoga, the Ashtanga Institute, and it's based in Mysore in Southern India. Okay. So I know it seems a little crazy to most people that I'd spend that much time, but that's what I've done. So what would be the, the, the difference between this type and your kind of regular type of yoga? It's a very dynamic style, but it's based on the breathing process. So basically that you suppose you synchronize your movement with your breath all the time. Wow. So it's very, you really get the cardiovascular system moving and then you have to be able to coordinate your breath every time you move as well. So and have you ever had anybody pass out doing this? Um, not yet. <laughs> oh, I feel like maybe. Do we have that oxygen tank already, Lindy? It's all sorted. I'm just looking at the fear. St. John's ambulance are in the corner. <laughs> and can I ask? Dreadful coordination as well. <laughs> this is just going to what be What are you good at, Carl? <laughs> well, I'm just curious. Testing stuff out. <laughs> all right, okay. Uh, what part of India, boy, did you say? So it's a place called Mysore, which is a style of yoga in southern India. It's just south of, um, it's about three hours north of Bangalore. Right, so okay. So in southern India. And what I teach back in Dublin then are early morning classes and they're called Mysore style. Mm. So I'd have a packed room every morning, six o'clock, all the Irish up doing this Ashtanga yoga every morning. Six a.m. Yeah. That, that's commitment, Jenny. That is commitment. Do you have to be very flexible to no, do this? No, it's all shapes, all sizes, all levels, complete beginners, experience. Some of the other Ashtanga teachers come in to me in the morning, so it's a whole mishmash. It's okay, cool. that's okay, but have you ever had somebody like Carl <laughs> do this before? <laughs> She's been blind now. Like Carl, I don't know if I've seen so much spandex. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. You talk about me as if I'm another species. <laughs> <laughs> Anyone like Carl. <laughs> uh, what did, you were saying, Gillian, before we went on air here, uh, you've got some uh, charity work you're doing, some stuff? I have, yeah. It's just a cause very close to my heart. Aware, supporting, supporting the 450,000 people in Ireland. That's like one in ten suffering from depression in Ireland at the mm. moment. So we're running um, on Saturday. Saturday week, the 13th of December at 10 o'clock till half 11 in the Carmelite Community Centre on Angel Street, a charity class and all proceeds go directly to AWARE. Fantastic. And AWARE will be on board on the day. We'll have buckets for donations. There'll be information leaflets and everybody for people coming along, family members that like, might like to 
get some advice about mm. what their their um, options are. And we also have the Happy Pair on board. They're doing the food afterwards. Oh, lovely. So, yeah, nice veggie breakfast for everybody afterwards. Nice. And um, then as well as that, I have a New Year retreat. So if anyone's looking for an alternative kind of New Year's, maybe a nice healthy five days of Ashtanga yoga, Carl's probably going to be coming along. Yeah, Jenny, I think you should probably hit <laughs> that as well. I could probably do it, to be fair. <laughs> Yeah, so it's five days of Ashtanga yoga, amazing veg- vegetarian food, Lovely. hill walks, etc. And it's only about an hour from Dublin in South Wicklow. Who it's works? a retreat centre. So yeah. it's a proper, you know, cleanse really for, for oh, yeah, starting total, in the new year. Yeah, rejuvenate after the Christmas. So it's from the 29th of December to the 2nd of January. Okay, so all info is on your website, ashtangayogaireland.ie. Yes, indeed. Okay. Yeah. Okay, well, right. what are we going to do? What are we going to do to Carol? Well, <laughs> <laughs> let's get to the business. <laughs> the joy in your face uh-huh. and how you say that is what worries Look me Look at here. you. What are we going to do to What her? are we going to do to Carl? <laughs> Gillian Mooney, he's all yours. <laughs> I think judging, looking at the fear in his face, we're going to keep it really simple to begin with. Okay. And we're going to do the basic fundamental posture, which is the sun salutation. Okay. Which is normally practiced before sunrise. But oh. we let him get away with it nearly lunchtime for, for today. Okay. So have you got a mat? Uh, oh, okay, we got the mat. In. Also, that's a mat on the floor, not like mats down the corridor. Going mats, yeah, get mat in for a second. So I, have to r- I think we'll give you the pink one. Okay, yeah. Uh, just to let people know who are listening at home, this is being videoed. We will have it up on our page, uh, just in case anyone's like, I'm missing out. You're not. We've got a beautiful pink mat. Spandex <laughs> Carl beautiful. is ready to go. Now, there's no risk of me like getting stuck in a position or something like Listen, that, is there? You realise well, you're you're just standing on the floor. How are you going to get stuck? No, but like we're not putting you through a hole or, or something. Like that. <laughs> <laughs> well, we don't know where, Gillian, what position she's going to get him into here. We're going to start off nice and easy for him, OK? OK. So the first one, the sun salutation. So stand at the top of the mat. OK, so I'll stand, be- I'll stand behind you. Now, keep oh. your feet together. OK. Now, inhale. Bring your arms overhead. Look up at your hands overhead, Carl. Oh, they're tight. Oh, oh, <laughs> you're praying. Close your, open your fingers, I should say. Now, exhale, come down. Touch your toes. Come on. You're super flexy. Come on. Go head on. Go, go on. on. Go on. Go away. Inhale, head up, Carl. Straight back. Now, exhale, step back. Kind of like you're doing a press up, but keep your elbows in. Try it. Okay. Hands flatten the ground. Wait, like this? Yeah, come oh, down, but okay. keep yourself off the ground. You're yeah, looking great, Carl. This has a bit Don't of a go. plank look about it, yeah. doesn't it? Down yeah, he's planking it. Hold it, elbows <laughs> need to be in. Oh, Lord. Oh. Elbows in. Oh, Lord, it troubles so hard. Now, inhale, curl over on the toes. How you doing, Carl? Over, over on your toes. What does that mean? <laughs> Jillian is now and standing now, on his back. Can I get on? <laughs> Okay, it's a fiver if you want to have a go. Put your tummy there and take a few breaths. I'm just going down the road. Now, it's like a circus. Can we have a ride on the horse, please? Up on the pony. Up straight. Bring your head down. Carl, your face is very red. It's like your t-shirt. Inhale, arms overhead. Now, again. Carl, I now reiterate. Hands. When and was the last time head. you farted? <laughs> Now that's great. Don't Let's make move a on a little bit now, You're Carl. Mean. So we might move to maybe sticking the leg behind the head. What do you think? Oh, go on. Listen, I think that's a good he's idea. Nice and open. Go I think on. He's, he's nice and supple now, flexible now. He's warmed up. Do you want me to show you? You've opened up your oh. chakras okay, there. You, have a, you give it a go. So if you can down. get me my, to get my head over my leg. Oh. Jillian is now on the floor. Fair. Carl has joined her. Carl's eye, are you crying, Carl? Me no. So your eyes look. <laughs> <laughs> are you okay? Do you need oxygen? <laughs> But I'm like, get, get me. <laughs> <laughs> I've never done this before. <laughs> okay. I never have had someone like him. <laughs> You're very special, okay, Carl. Bring your leg up like this for me. Okay. Hook it in like you're cradling a baby. Can this you way. Bring can you put your big toe in your mouth? I I used to be able to do that. Yes. Yes. Dying like to this. see that later. Now. We'll also bring put that up in the video. You will. Just push it. Carl, push it. Be- Believe in yourself. Come on. Oh, Jillian. Jillian now has her head completely around her. Come on, Carl. I don't think you need. I don't think you deep. Okay. Okay. Jillian, are those legs real? Easier way to do it. Lie down, flatten the ground. Hey, Jen. Jen. Get into it. Don't worry. Now, pop your legs behind your head from here, Carl. Right. Jenny Green can do it. Look. Look. In tight jeans. I'll show you now. Here oh, we go. Please, look, please do. Look yes. at look at the way Jillian demonstrates. Yeah. Look, just <laughs> see this way. There you go. You're nearly there, Carl. You're nearly there, Carl. 
Here's Come on, Jillian. There. There. No, Jillian has her two legs around her head. <laughs> Come on, oh, come on, Carl. You need not, I will break my pelvis. Jenny, can you do that? I, I, I kind of can, but I'm in this low jeans. I'd rather I not. If that's okay. Nice, calm. <laughs> this will all be up on our website and our Twitter. If I sat later on. on him, would it flatten them down a bit? I've ever found myself in. Try your other leg. Try, okay, maybe the other leg's a bit yeah, I think, yeah, it's it's probably yeah, a bit. That looser. hamstring looks a little bit more. I'm sweating, it's warm. Do you know what? If I'm honest, I can't see that ever happening. Well, that's not going. We further. could leave him there, little Chris. Jillian, how do you think he's doing, by the way? Um, <laughs> I think with time, dedication, <laughs> there's a, there's hope. Are you sure? <laughs> any any tips on how I could get this any further? Could, any any tips on how we can make if him you pair, stand back up? Maybe if you paired a bit off the end of your leg. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's so warm. All right. <laughs> Let's have a bit. Let's take a break and then we we'll go some, with some Green Day. Car, keep going. Keep going. Hang on, you're nearly there. Come on. Look, Gillian will show you. She has her two legs around her head. Oh, it's easy. Actually, you're getting FM, American idiot, especially for you, Carl Mullen. I think that the spandex limited my movement. Yeah, you did. <laughs> in fairness, Julian did ask you to remove your shorts so, so you'd be more flexible. And see if it's any better. Now, dur go. during the break, Jenny Green, and I kid you not, this is true, put one foot right behind her head. Not a butter In my jeans as well. Look at these. Not Just to make it more of a show of me. Jillian, if you jump, wouldn't mind jumping in there, well, how, were you impressed with Jenny? I was very <laughs> impressed with Jenny. And also with Carl, in fairness. Exactly. <laughs> Can I just say, in Carl's defence, the only reason I I think I am so flexible is because I'm so unfit. I don't have any muscle tones. There's nothing to be tight. <laughs> so that's what it is. Well, I, I'm going to stand up for the lads here. I think lads' hamstrings are a lot tighter than women's. They must be. That's mainly because they're all playing soccer, football, and everything, and it tightens up the hamstrings for the guys. Yeah. But in see. time, that low. How long would I need to work at that now to get my head over my lips? You should. By the time you're about sixty. <laughs> a bit of a job in our hands but you know we could but nothing but like a bit of hard work a bit of graft and we'll Six get months. there um oh, i think okay. what we'll do is if you come in too you could assist me oh yeah for the charity class in support of aware on the 13th now, that December. just means drive her there and drive her home <laughs> <laughs> do a little bit of demonstrating for us. So this is how you don't do this? <laughs> Actually, I think that is a great idea. And for anybody Encourage else... Who, all the Irish men. And yeah. then you can come along on the New Year retreat as well and entertain us all for the five days. That is can brilliant. I, can I put a challenge there, Carl? Honestly, would you do this and come back in six months and get your two legs around yeah, your head? No, I w I'd love <laughs> to try that. I would 100% love that six months to try. Yeah. Two legs might be a push now. <laughs> But one leg over the head. I'll try both. If you get the two behind, I'll rock you. <laughs> <laughs> Down the hill. That's six, so what is it? Six months from now. That's yeah. Well, G oh, Gillian, how long? Realistically, Listen, we how long? might even still be here. <laughs> um, I would reckon a good six months of early morning classes. So you'll have to come on. My classes start around six o'clock in the morning. Oh, yes. Carlos. So we'll be in there. We'll give him, no, you can start at half six. We'll yeah, ah, there you go. We'll you're great. Pass. Come you can start at half six, six mornings a week. Teacher's pet. Is that how much it's going to take Thick for me to get my leg over? Have my you head? seen yourself, Troy? <laughs> <laughs> was I that far off? Yes. <laughs> uh, you weren't too bad. Your right leg was no, he was. was better. Okay, okay. You know? <laughs> so, anyone who's listening, Ashtanga Yoga Ireland.ie, they can get details for the classes in the, the, that are running in the new year and also for Aware, which is Saturday week, isn't that right? That's right. Saturday, the 13th of December. Brilliant. And uh, uh, classes are for, you can go, you can be complete beginners or at any level to go and start all this. All levels are very welcome this. in the mornings, yeah. Gillian, right. thank you so much. Thank it's brilliant to have you in. Thank you, Carl. Well, well done, everybody. Well done, Gillian. Well done, Carl. 